guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is QD Sherry. For today's video, we're going to be doing an eye look using the new Juvia's Place palette. This is the Wahala's palette. So I have purchased this like a month ago, but I just never got around to doing any looks. So for today, I'm not sure exactly what look we're gonna do. So this palette has um, 20 shades some press glitters and um, some MAC colors. So I am going to go ahead and swatch um, two colors, which is the clout and the pepper body. So these are those two colors. And one thing that you could say that with Juvia's Place, their um, eyeshadows are always pigmented. So that's the one thing you could give to them. So these are the two colors that I swatch. I could swatch more, but there's probably like a million videos doing the same thing. So for today, okay. to prime my eyes, I used the MAC NC42, and then I went in with the Juvia's Place um, setting powder to set the concealer. So, let's see. And your girl is hot, like it is so hot. Um, so I think I am going to go in with fire and I'm going to put that in my crease area. So my original plan was not to do a cut crease, but look at it now. Looking at it now, it looks like that is exactly where I'm at. I wanted to do a no cut crease look. But this is starting to look good on cut crease. So as you can see, this is like super, super pigmented. Like I am just going with the flow. I have no idea what look I want to do. No idea whatsoever, but for some reason, looks like I'll be doing a cut crease. So I just went in with fire. So I am most likely so maybe I'm gonna go in with this purple right here, BU. I'm gonna go and use this one and try to blend that out. Now I'm trying to blend the fire and BU together to see what look I come up with. So I'm actually losing some of the purple, I mean I'm losing some of the red. I'm losing some of the red so I'm going to go back in and apply some more red when I'm finished blending the purple. blend my eyeshadows I am basically just tapping the two colors together this is the 
across my crease so it's a P. Louise Acid Rain Blank Canvas. I'm going to cut my crease using this. So let me know if you guys are feeling this look so far. I am just going with the flow. I have no idea what look that I am going for. I am just randomly just doing my eyes. Like I have no idea what look I'm going for. Now that I've done that, uh, let's see which color I should go in with. Like, I really like clouds. Oh, I'm like messing up my nails. So I really like clouds, which is this one. And I really like Bianca, which is this one. Sorry to give you the finger, <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, so I like those two. So I just might as well, I'm thinking that I am going to go in with cloud. But what I'll do is I'll go in with this blue color right here and I'll put that on my lid first before I put down on this color right here. Go ahead and put that over the shade of blue.
I'm gonna go ahead and do my foundation of camera and I'll be using all Juvier's Place products. I'm gonna use the foundation in the number 230, the concealer in the number 12, and then I'm going to use their setting powder and their highlighter and I'm gonna do this off camera and I'll be back with it. Okay, so now that I've done, put on my makeup, so now that I've done my makeup, I'm gonna go back in and finish my under eyes. And I'm gonna go back in with the color Love and Fire, and I'm just gonna put those two quick under my eyes. So thank you guys so much for watching my channel. So this was my review or my first impression using the Juvia's palette. So let me know if you guys like the eye look and leave some comments down below if you're feeling this look. Thank you guys so much for watching my channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.